Today is January 20th, and here's today's tie. History, holidays, birthdays, and more. Tie reveal at the end. A different tie every day for more than a year now, and here are five things you should know from today in history. On this date in 1869, Elizabeth Cady Stanton became the first woman to testify before the United States Congress. She was a woman's rights activist and an abolitionist. In 1980, Jimmy Carter announced a U.S. boycott on the Olympics in Moscow. It was to protest the Soviet invasion of Afghanistan. Sixty-five countries participated in the boycott. In 1981, hostages were released from the U.S. Embassy in Tehran. They had been held captive for 444 days. In 1982, heavy metal musician Ozzy Osbourne allegedly snacked on a bat. He was said to have bitten its head off while on stage in Des Moines, Iowa. And in 2021, Kamala Harris became the first female vice president of the United States. And since its inauguration day, most presidents since 1937 have taken office on this day. Today is also No Phones at Home Day, Take a Walk Outdoors Day, National Coffee Break Day, National Cheese Lovers Day, Soup Swap Day, International Day of Acceptance, National Camcorder Day, National Butter Crunch Day, National Disc Jockey Day, National Use Your Gift Card Day, and Penguin Awareness Day. Born on this day in 1775, Andre Ampere. Yes, he has a unit of electric current named after him. Yesterday, we remember James Watt's birthday. Powerful month. In 1872, prominent female architect Julia Morgan. In 1888, American blues 12-string guitarist Lead Belly. In 1896, George Burns. In 1923, singer-songwriter Slim Whitman. In 1906, Greek shipping magnate Aristotle Onassis. In 1920, Dr. Leonard McCoy from Star Trek to Forrest Kelly. And in 1930, a real astronaut, Buzz Aldrin. In 1952, co-founder of KISS, Paul Stanley. In 1956, political commentator and comedian, Bill Maher. And in 1997, rapper, Blueface. If it's your birthday today or if it's coming up, let us know in the comments section. Tie reveal! It's inauguration day, so I'm all American, almost. This is a Stonehenge tie, 100% silk, but made in China. And that's just some of what happened in history today.